I'm not gonna pay you. If you have a problem, get off your bike and handle it. If you have a problem, get off your bike and handle it like a man. So stop talking, I'm not gonna pay you nothing. Hey, what's up guys, it's Arabian Gains, and today I'm right here, uh, Main Street and Cesar E. Chavez. It's uh, around uh, Oliveira Street. I'm not that far from there. So there's a homeless encampment right here. I'm gonna walk through it guys and show you how the living condition and if somebody's willing to talk to me that'll be good. If not, at least you guys could take a look and see. So here we go. Right here they have a generator. I'm sure you could hear that. All right, let's walk. So you guys could see their living conditions and how the living condition is. Hey, do people come and help you guys? Oh, man. Yeah. Do people help you guys right no. here? Sometimes they do, sometimes they don't. Do they you know donate or anything? Yeah. Are you guys here after COVID or? Uh, I don't know. Also. We got, where are you recording from? Uh, I just do a YouTube videos, try to bring awareness so people can come and support you guys, like bring your food and stuff. All right, thank you. All right. So there's a, a huge encampment, it go over a, a few streets, I'm gonna have to walk it all, kind of get a little confusing. So now we are right here, Cesar E. Chavez and New High. people working here I'm going to make a turn right here I know there's straight ahead there's more but I'll walk there I'll try to walk there after I'm done if I'm not that far oh no I guess it's the other way I guess so confusing See the city having took the trash out. Thus you could blame the city for it. Look how the city leaves the trash. And there's somebody sleeps out there. Uh, the streets are here is clean. You can tell the homeless they put everything by the designated uh, trash area, but the city haven't came and picked up anything. I don't know why. And across the street, there's the encampments over there. Uh, the gentleman over there, 
in that red car was giving them food and stuff. He's actually giving the homeless something to eat, I think. I see him giving bags. So back right here, this is where I'm at. Again, look, the city haven't even dumped the trash. All right, they have a uh, water, water faucet. So if you guys want to help them, uh, you know the area, let's just go to Cesar E. Chavez. It's around the Oliveira Street area. It's not too hard to see these guys. As you see, they're keeping their streets clean. Uh, and now the problem is at the city because they're not dumping the trash, they're not changing the trash. We see this everywhere. See if somebody willing to talk. Uh, excuse me. Do they help you right here? Do people bring you water or food? People bring you water and food here. All right. It's okay. Dudes are gonna be okay. Get away from those dudes. People help you guys right here. Yeah, we're all there. Yeah. People bring you food, water. Yeah. Thank you, Calvin Klein. Calvin Klein. Okay. Two men, two did. I made Macy's. Yeah, we're fight for our Belgium, but if you can't be with those people and you're legal, come fuck out with us. Yes. We'll protect you. Thank you. Yeah. I don't understand anything. All right, look right here. They have a place. All right. Now, oh, look, another problem where the city not dumping their trash look at this this is the high taxes that people who live in LA County pay high taxes to see this trash all right now let's try to do a legal jaywalk to the other end there's more encampments right here This is huge right here. Again, you guys see how uh, most of the trash is actually on the city side. Right here, if you see, you guys see, the city is not dumping their trash at all. Do people come and help you guys here? People help you guys? I can't hear you. Where are you at? I can't hear you. All right. Hi. Somebody's yelling from the tent. I couldn't hear him. All right. I'm going to take this turn and go down there. There's more. So this is basically, you can see in front of you the 10 freeway east and the 5 freeway south Union Station. So this is Rush Wright. Everybody sees that. You, I mean, anybody drives around the LA area will see this. You can actually see this from the freeway. If you look right here, this is the freeway right here. 
people from the freeway could see the homeless encampments so the LA County just seems to be okay with this representation I know the homeless they had a fund but the money was located somewhere else and a lot of money went missing from that homeless fund oh this is bad all right the small homeless encampments here And I'm gonna turn over there. So right now I'm gonna walk the other way. What's up? Why? What's up? What? I'm trying to bring awareness to you guys, so people can come and help you guys out. I ain't paying you nothing, but I'll keep videoing. If you have a problem, I mean, you could... Well, if you have a problem... If you have a problem, I mean, handle it. Either you gotta pay me. I'm not paying you nothing. Do something about it. I'm not paying you nothing. So do something about it. All right? I'm not gonna pay you. If you have a problem, get off your bike and handle it. If you have a problem, get off your bike and handle it like a man. So stop talking. I'm not gonna pay you nothing. Try to extort me? You're dreaming, man. Wow. This guy wants me to pay him. Try to bring awareness to these guys. And he wants to get paid. Like I told him, you know, get off your bike and handle it. So I don't know where I'm at right now. Okay, I have to go straight. I believe there's encampments that i seen. Kind of, where are we at? This guy threw me off. But yeah, I'm gonna go straight. This guy just ruined my day. All right, let's keep going. These guys are here trying to intimidate people. If I'm a video, I have to pay him. <laughs> okay. All right. So there's a homeless encampment right there. So you guys can come here. Feel free to come and help these guys. But I really don't think you should pay anybody money right here. Help them with food, water, basic necessities. That's about it. I don't really come to this area that much. I like to stay away from this area. And as you see, I'm sure you guys don't even blame me. But I could see that guy with the bicycles kind of circling a little bit behind me. He will never intimidate me. I know I'm not a superman or anything, but I could defend myself. See more trash. Oh, as you see, see guys right here. This is right here, probably a pee bottles. The homeless pee right here, and they put it right there because there's no restrooms. I know this is pee. I know for sure this is not orange juice or lemonade. So the city having came and picked up anything yet, as we can see. All right, now I'm at, oh, let me take my sunglasses off, Alameda Street, Alameda Street and Alameda, oh, so, okay, I'm across. Yeah, well, I came 
I came by a huge encampment in one of those streets and now I'm kind of lost after that guy kind of put me in a bad mood so I'll continue walking and I'll get to that other encampment for now in a second I'll see you guys in a few minutes hey what's up people I came here and I found this it was like behind me I was kind of lost hey guys do people help you out right here do you bring your food water oh all right so yeah i get confused a little bit i'm glad i found my way all right right here this is the encampment i was talking about hey do people help you guys right here to bring you food water they do that's good. Are you here because of COVID? After COVID? Just homeless? All right, man. Yeah, I'm trying to bring awareness. Hopefully people, you know, come and help you guys. And this is uh, Main Street, right? Uh, I think Los Angeles or something. Main Street, okay. All right, thank you. So as you see, people come help them out. People come help these people out. That's good. See, there's friendly people and there's a Somebody like that guy we just seen a minute ago on a bicycle. All right. So this is actually stretches a little bit far. I'll walk it for you guys. And also go down into there in the building there is a tent over there too so you guys know where the address at this building right here is james it's a city hall east 200 200 city hall east so this actually is clean right here for somehow the city only emptied the trash that close to their city hall there's a there's like a tent on the street or what used to be a tent not sure why since you probably somebody's stuff all right wow trash right here all of us clean there's a trash down there the trash is full Wendy right here a little bit All right, this is temple and main you guys can't it's easy to find it's Fletcher Warren Square right here I know summer's approaching so I think a cold water for these guys will be good because see right here there's some homeless right there but they're no, with no tents the people with the tents are right here. All right. It's uh, I heard that they're going to try to find a solution for the homeless. Like, you know how they cleared up Echo Park and they put them in hotels. 
the hotel they put them in it was failing business they didn't have a good business so i guess the city made a deal with that hotel where they could put homeless out there so that worked out just fine for them but i think instead of putting these people in hotels the city needs to actually build buildings for them and house them okay look right there there's another one so need to kind of build building and house them and basically find them a place to stay because the money that it costs the city to put the homeless in a hotel motel they could actually build real shelters for them but nobody see it that way all right I'm back at Eliso where that guy tried to intimidate me, I guess, the one who wanted money. That's no, not right here, around the area. Anyway, this is it, guys. Uh, as you've seen, uh, I took you around right here, lay closer to the Oliveira Street, uh, Cesar Chavez. Uh, it's all over the place. So, you guys seen the homeless encampments? If you want to come help these guys, summer's approaching. I think water is good vegetables fruits something to keep them hydrated so you know where it's at and i'll see you guys in uh, future videos